hello friends welcome to my youtube channel it's on tutorial in this video we are discuss about assignment 7 solution of problem solving through programming in c here you can see that the first question is the searching operation in an array is done using first option is key and index second option is only key third only index and fourth option is none of these so the correct answer is question number first is option number a key and index Question number second. Find the output of the following C program. Hatch include standard input output dot header int main. So the first option is hello, second h, third hello, fourth compiler error. So the proof of the question number second is here. Here is the code and then execute compile and run then output will be output will be fellows that means correct answer is question number second is option number a fellows question number third what will be the output of this code first option is n1 equal to 18 n2 equal to 17 second option is n1 equal to 18 n2 equal to 18 third option is n1 equal to 17 n1 equal to 17 fourth option is n1 equal to 17 n2 equal to 18 so the proof of the question number third is here here is the code and then execute compile and run then output will be n1 equal to 18 n2 equal to 17 that means correct answer is question number third is option number a question number four consider the following c program segment the output will be g nuts second g nut third string fourth no output is printed so the proof of the question number four is here Here is the code. Then execute and run. Compile and run. Then output will be output will be nothing. That means no output. That means correct answer is question number four is option number D. No output will be printed. Question number five. What will be the value of I after the execution of C code given below? First option is 0, second is 1, third is minus 1, fourth is none. So the explanation of question number 5 is here. Correct answer is 0. That means question number 5, option number 1 is true. 0. Question number 6. If the starting address of an float array 10 10 is 2000 what will be the memory address of the element first 2268 second 2120 third 2224 fourth 2144 so the explanation of question number six yeah correct answer is question number six is option number c question number seven in C, the placement of element of a two-dimensional array is first option is row wise, second option is column wise, third option is diagonal wise, fourth option is bottom to top wise. So the correct answer is question number seven is option number B, D, bottom to top wise. Question number eight, what will be the output? Here is the code. So the proof of the question number 8 is here. Here is the code and then I execute compile and run. Then output will be here. Output will be 3 to 1, 0, 0, 4. So the correct answer is question number 8 is 3 to 1, 0, 0, 4 is correct answer. Question number 9. 
what will be the output first option is the string is empty second option is the string is not empty third error fourth none of the above so the proof of the question number nine is here here is the code and then i execute compile and run then output will be this string is not empty that means correct answer is question number 9 is option number b the string is not empty question number 10 what is the output of the following c code first compilation error second 7 third 1 fourth 2 so the proof of the question number 10 is here here is the code and then execute compile and run then output will be nothing but that means complete completion error so the correct answer is question number 10 is option number a now week 7 program 1 here is code ये कोड आपको यहां पे टाइप कर लेना है यदि आप टाइप नहीं करते हैं तो इस कोड को सिंपली इस कोड को मैंने टेलीग्राम चैनल पे पेस्ट कर दिया हूं यहां से आप कॉपी करके यहां पे आप पेस्ट कर सकते हैं टेलीग्राम चैनल का लिंक मैं डिस्क्रिप्शन बॉक्स में डाल देता हूं आप वहां से ज्वाइन करके यहां से कोड को कॉपी कर लेंगे सिंपली यहां से पेस्ट यहां पे पेस्ट करने के बाद आपको सिंपली सबमिट कर लेना है सेव एज ड्राफ्ट एंड सबमिट मैं आप लोगों को यहां पे एक बार चेक करके दिखा देता हूं कि कोड सही है गलत इसके लिए मैं एक बार कंपाइल एंड रन पे क्लिक करता हूं देन आउटपुट विल बी पास्ट दैट मींस दिस कोड इज करेक्ट नो वीक सेवन प्रोग्राम टू नो हेयर इज दिस कोड जिसको आपको कॉपी पेस्ट करना है इस कोड को मैंने भी यहां पे डाल रखा है तो यहां से आप सिंपली कॉपी कर लेंगे और यहां पेस्ट कर लेंगे सेव एज ड्राफ्ट एंड सबमिट मैं इस कोड को भी एक बार आप लोग को चेक करके दिखा देता हूं कि सही है या गलत then compile and run output will be passed that means this code is correct now week 7 program 3 here is code आपको simply इस code को भी copy करके यहां पे पेस्ट कर लेना है मैंने इस कोड को भी यहां पे टेलीग्राम पे सेंड कर रखा हूं देन सबमिट मैं एक बार इस कोड को भी चेक कर लेता हूं कंपाइल एंड रन आउटपुट आउटपुट विल बी पास्ड दैट मींस कोड इज दिस कोड इज करेक्ट नाउ वीक 7 प्रोग्राम 4 हियर इज द कोड and save as draft and submit now i will check this code is right here wrong here the output will be passed that means this code is correct so thank you guys we will meet in the next assignment